Alright, what is up? This is Soul Plays back for Dragon Ball Fusions for the Nintendo 3DS. So today, guys, I'm bringing you another Fusion Focus slash Fusion Showcase on a Street Pass Fusion. As always, guys, today is very exciting and this video actually is inspired and sort of derives from a previous video that we just recently did, which was the Demon Tira or the Toa and Mira Fusion. So pretty much throughout the entire comment section, even though we did get a lot with, you know, some really good likes and comments and just thumbs up and everything, once again, I appreciate the feedback. This one in particular was sort of a decision that came to me last night when I was looking through it on that video. A couple of people were recommending that I fuse Mira and fuse Zamasu. So I'll put up on screen like just a couple of examples of comments pretty much explaining, you know, how it works and what it looks like. So apparently this is supposed to look like the final form Mira from Dragon Ball's Universe 2. So this video contains a massive spoiler. It's already in the thumbnail. I mean, it's in the title and everything. If you don't know who Final Form Mirror is, I'm just going to tell you, just click off this video right now if you don't want to be spoiled from Xenoverse 2, but I'm gonna say it right now. He is the final boss of Dragon Ball's Universe 2, and it's a transformation. It's really cool. It looks amazing, and it was supposed to be a fusion between Mira and Toa. That's why I thought, okay, what would it look like if we actually did that in the game? So a couple of days ago when we actually did the fusion, it looked nothing like it. Still looks very cool, but I was a little bit disappointed and salty about it. So that's why I really want to do this sort of just freeform fusion, and we're going to see what it looks like. Hopefully, it looks exactly what people say it will and we're just going to go straight on into it so before we get started guys do me a huge favor and hit that like button should reach 15 likes on this video that'd be amazing i'd really appreciate it plus it shows that you guys want to see more dragon ball fusions content on this channel as well as the continuation of the street pass freeform fusion series so let's jump straight on into this shit with the freeform fusion and there he is mira once again you guys already know his stats and everything don't have to go over it for like the second or third actually no this is like only the second time i don't really do too many fusions that aren't you know sane based i feel like the same based ones are you know a staple to the channel at this point because there's so many different fucking sayings and so many combinations that you can do that you know it's just starting to become crazy <laughs> so now we got mira and we're gonna fuse with an already fused character so a triple fusion uh very strange but i'm excited oh shit dude the hair the hair's looking just like it so yes fucking mira in his final form sort of shit or whatever although this probably won't look identical to it because he has like the fur it's almost like a super saiyan 4 but if i fuse with the super saiyan 4 it would you know get i guess goku's black hair and everything this one just works really well if it's going to look exactly what i think it will what my perception will be but he is maxed out level 100 technique type which is pretty cool i mean you know technique why not <laughs> S rank, uh, we have 31k HP, 917 melee, 1601 key blast, 1197 defense, and 15 luck. So not a lot of luck, but the key blast definitely makes up for all of you know his stats in general because that is a shit ton of just blasting and key and yeah <laughs> special attacks my boys all right so we got hyper barrier illusion thunder and divine wrath divine wrath is a really cool move it works well with this fusion i guess because you know it's wrath it's divine he's got the hair you know a lot of just crazy shit so special skills not seeing anything we have ex regeneration uh ultra attack super elite royalty and imperial wrath so much wrath this dude is pissed like i mean it is his final form in a way but we can learn a ton of awesome moves. Ooh, if I taught him Black Kamehameha, how hype would that be? I wonder if he can learn... Uh, oh, okay, Majin Kamehameha. I could probably teach him that just for, you know, shits and giggles. But we also have this right here, you know, an off-worlder. He has to be because he is a fusion between two off-worlders in a way. So an Andrew created by Toa who hails from the demon realm. She's trying to collect energy to create the ultimate warrior. Well, this motherfucker has done it. <laughs> We're going to be helping her today and assisting her in that aspect and creating this just powerful ass character. The hair alone is so unique. I cannot wait to see what this looks like. Hopefully it's still, you know, that pure white color. Oh shit. Oh shit. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Whoa yo okay i like his eyes how they're like that pale gray color like this dude is demonic oh shit okay so he did get the bottom half sort of tunic from the supreme kai sort of clothing that he wears 
in Fuzumasu's, you know, entire character. And then the hair, it looks just like it, except the back doesn't have that, like, mullet effect where it's really long. You know, Super Saiyan Force, for some reason, their hair gets really long in the back, but the front, there's not really much. So, party in the back, business in the front, or whatever the fuck that term is for mullets. But yeah, this hair looks awesome. I love that one piece that just juts out right there. It's so unique. I don't know why Fuzumasu, his hair has to be like that. Like, why you gotta make it so dope, man? Holy shit, this looks awesome. So he does have a grayish sort of color on the top half too. So there's a lot of synergy. Like, the coloration and everything, it's very monotone. And his skin with that, like, dark, just pale blue. This is awesome, dude. I'm so excited. I gotta see this character. If only he could just straight up get the fur from the super saiyan 4 and have the light blue skin i would love that shit and then we could just say fuck it we got final four mirror in this game <laughs> so let's go ahead and put him on our team and check this dude out oh my goodness man this looks amazing this actually looks just as i expected i mean there's not really too much you can change about his clothing and that's one problem with freeform fusions is that i wish or just in this game in general that you could like customize any character that you wanted to like whether it be a you know custom character already or just a character like this along these lines where it's just you know set in dragon ball z a character that you can obtain and you could just like mess with the clothing especially with freeform fusions because i mean we have to do a lot of work for this shit constantly two 3ds's back and forth but man this is awesome let's go ahead and check him out on the character list and one last pan around for this dude he is so beautiful oh my goodness dude the hair the hair is on point this is fucking final form mira this gets me so excited like i love this game so much i don't know why it takes fusions that are just so ridiculously strong to be you know just like some of the best in the game i mean i guess that would make sense but still like why why did why do we have to do this <laughs> Why do we got to be crazy with everything? So let's go ahead and fight the random red energy team mofos and we're gonna try this dude out I'm gonna you know customize his moveset a little bit better give him maybe like Majin Kamehameha and I will see you guys back over there All right guys, so here we are in the random red energy team We got my boy final form mirror or our mock-up of this character and his new transformation and holy shit He's pretty fast. He's already up there at the front ready to go with the EX regenerate. Did you see that shit? I don't know if that said 113 or like 11k or something. I, I don't know if I read that wrong, but he got a ton of HP just from that. I think it was like 11k. Motherfucker is crazy. Look at this dude. Arms crossed. He's got this like black like wristband sort of armor on. Or it's almost like a gauntlet. And the fusion bracelet is just so hype. I really wish he had earrings too. If he had the earrings, that would make this all the more special. So we have 11, 12 melee. 1756 key blast oh my god that's ridiculous special moves um unfortunately i wasn't able to give him majin kamehameha because i think i taught that to somebody else earlier so i don't know for whatever reason i thought i had it because i'm a dumbass but we're definitely going to try out divine wrath uh super spirit blade and illusion thunder i want to try out all of these so i am currently not close enough to hit them so we're going to get in on this shit with a key blast and he is a technique type so he can hit multiple mofos at a time oh shit look at this dude his hair is so clean dude why why does he have to be so cool like i'm just questioning why this is so amazing but it's dragon ball fusions like they they have to make it look good like i've done a couple of fusions on my own like on my own time just trying it out with the freeform fusion uh with my other 3ds and some of them look like absolute shit like they get messed up i think there was one fusion that i was trying to attempt and it was like Botamo and Boo. It was something that sounded so ideal and just like perfect. Like two fat motherfuckers. Like the big boys, man. <laughs> we love that shit. Two fluffy, jolly guys. And fused together, it would make sort of like, I don't know, my perception of it was going to be like Majin Boo. And he was like yellowish gold color. And then he had ears. That would be so cool. And he'd be adorable too. It's going to charge up key. And... No, it didn't look like that at all. He actually got buffed. Like, his his physique, he had Majin Buu's fat face. Like, I'm talking about the fat good Buu, not kid Buu. And his physique, like the, the torso and everything, and his arms and legs were muscular. It made no sense. Like, I don't know how many fusions you guys have done in the past, but this... <laughs> It just blows my mind how shitty it looked, and I was I was very disappointed. So, I guess we could do Super Spirit Blade because it looks super cool. And would that kill? Oh, that's gonna kill him. Okay, so I can't do that yet. 
All right, here, hold up. We're going to go for the... Uh, oh, shit, shit, shit. Let me charge up key. We got to use Divine Wrath. If we're going to use anything, Divine Wrath is the way to go because I don't want to waste it. So, yeah, it's just kind of disappointing to see that at times. And unfortunately, uh, this game is sort of weird. Like, it's kind of automatic. It detects it, and it's just like a render of these characters when they fuse together. So we can't always expect them to look amazing or even some of them look, will look terrible. Like, they look like absolute dog shit. <laughs> so... If I don't get to one of your requests, if you guys have them, it's because sometimes I need to try them out on my own, especially now that I know that some of them look really bad. And I'll tell you if they look good or not. Like, I just kind of have to, you know, interpret it for myself. So, unfortunately, that is the case with the Butamo. Like, even the name sounded perfect, Butamo. So, anybody that did request that, um, I just wanted to say big, massive apology. And I'm sorry, man. It just didn't look good at all. Like, it... It looked awful <laughs> like it looked really bad but if you guys really really want to see a nasty looking like muscular boo that i mean it's just boo boo's head and he's yellowish gold color and he's really muscular it doesn't look like boo tamo at all like i could just say that about like a super saiyan boo or some something stupid like that but man how are you guys doing on this fine i think it's thursday man so tgif tomorrow thank god <laughs> been waiting for this week to end it's been a struggle, uh, you know, this was my first week back after spring break, so it does suck, I know, uh, maybe some of you guys are actually on spring break right now, so, hey, hope you guys are enjoying the content, hope you, hopefully, you guys are just chilling, big chilling, relaxing, spending time with family, remember, family is important, and, uh, you know, just have a good time right now, just shout outs to all you, <laughs> all you dudes out there, so special move, Divine Wrath, okay, so this is like a... A massive beam of energy? Okay, I don't think I've ever used this move before. Oh shit, Child Blow teaming up with us. Oh, okay, so this is Divine Wrath. <laughs> what? Oh! oh my god, what? 90k! That looked epic as hell. So yeah, that was that weird move with the light, like, fucking, I don't even know, that symbol behind him. It's an exclusive to Fuse Zamasu. That's like one of his signature moves. So I didn't know it was called Divine Wrath. That is uh, that is a little bit scary now. Holy shit. So I guess we'll go and charge up his key one more time. And we're going to try it out. All right, guys. So here we go. KF Mirror, a.k.a. Final Form Mirror without his Super Saiyan 4 fur, which is very unfortunate. But hey, the hair looks cool. Uh, we're going to go for the special move. Should I use Illusion Thunder or Super Spirit Blade? All right. So Illusion Thunder we've seen before. This one is a melee base, so we just got to see it. I know he's he's all key-based, but melee just sounds cooler. I just got to see this shit with him just pulling out the sword. Oh, look at that. Hello. Look at my dick. Oh, 20k dicks. Let's go. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm retarded. I am crazy right now. I don't know why. I'm, I'm all over the place. That was hilarious. That This just gets me so hyped. I love... I fucking love this fusion it's amazing yes 32k exp very nice so there you have it my boy finally reaching his full power and potential all right guys so that's basically going to do it for this video thank you all so much for watching that was pretty much my mock-up kind of version of super saiyan 4 final form mirror whatever you want to call him i know he just doesn't look like a super saiyan 4 but maybe maybe we might do it in the future with super saiyan 4 goku as the basis and sort of fuse with him to see what it looks like maybe he'll get like the weird like blue skin and shit we'll see we'll see what happens but for now this is the closest that you can get to the final form mirror just because both characters have that sort of spiked up white kind of hair and even though you can tell in the very back portion it's sort of a uh, darker purplish kind of color because mirror does have that tint but definitely it works out it looks amazing hairstyles on point clothing is actually pretty dope and yeah i just love it Definitely one of the cooler fusions. Uh, can't say it's in my top 10 yet, but as we do more of these, I'll definitely try to do a top 10 very soon. Um, if, you know, I can find out something that would work, you know, maybe even a top five. I think that'd be easier. So please recommend any more fusions in the comment section below. And that's going to do it for this video. So I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Take care.